Alright everybody, welcome back to Vampire. As you guys know, I've been having some trouble uh, with it. Um, it likes to crash <laughs> after an hour. Uh, for some reason it causes my PlayStation to overheat and then my PlayStation just has a panic attack and is like, eh, <laughs> and decides to stop working. So we're going to see where this uh, autosave lasts. We were talking to Lady Ashbury and her adopted father, William Marshall. He was the knight who was infected by a disaster and inadvertently infected Elizabeth. Also, I was, you know, being like super like salty because 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 he's like, I love you, and I'm like, no. Okay, good. So it's saved here. So we can skip some of the dialogue. You have nothing to be. Now that I stand before you both. We still have a few minutes. Okay, I'm gonna skip the dialogue, but I'm just gonna ask it that way it's like there. I'm really sorry about all the crashes. Just my PlayStation doesn't like this game for some reason. Like it just wants to make life harder for me. Oh, the disaster. This creature that Harriet Jones had become. The epidemic is no more, and London will recover in time. Yes. You Keep did well, square. Jonathan. Like, shut up! <laughs> you truly saved the city. But yeah, yes, he's just like, now I have to find the woman I love, and Despite I'm like, or you can just stay in London. I'm truly Jeffrey's right there. We did it <laughs> I'm pretty sure I, I said that. I bear knowing I was the cause of all this through the use of my just own say. blood. No. We could go back. This catastrophe was the find result McCollum, of unethical experiments. Get married, adopt eighty kids, and the will of a creature so inexplicably evil. She exceeds all the terrible wonders I have seen since my death. But it was my blood all along. My corrupted blood of hate. The poisoned blood of my father. A healthy carrier. That's all I am. Yeah, she's got the blood of hate, as they call it, which is like vampire blood that's been tainted by a disaster. Why? Much. How could... Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Yeah, your dad gave me the antidote. After he's like, he decided to give her the antidote instead of taking it himself, so she wouldn't. Cause she like no, went on a fucking rampage. And he yes. We like could've... found her and like helped her. William Marshall infected you. You don't have to do these slow pans. He I don't care about her that much. <laughs> true original carrier. Yes. But he saved me by sacrificing himself. Saved you? How? The tears of angels. The cleansing of impure blood by an older, more powerful blood. It worked on I mean, we me, also found out that King yes. Arthur's blood was a vampire's blood, blood is which is hilarious, because species, scowls, McCollum drank it to try to kick my lineage. ass. <laughs> Do you like really think it worked? It has, Jonathan. I was nothing but a beast who took pleasure I hate vampires, and then like, he's been drinking vampire blood. I roamed across weeping my bloody Idiot. crop. Idiot. It was the blood of hate. But it was like but pure. It was, it was like, cured me. like blood from a pure source. Who like, are you? Could... Untainted by evil. I was Whoops. born Elizabeth Samantha Mary Englewood. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> How did you- He was an- I was gonna say, well, last time I was like, I, I, I did shouldn't you? cry. <laughs> this time I was like, who the fuck are you? What, a, what do you, you know? I love you. Uh, no. You should have told me. No, I don't Jonathan. love you. The William Marshall myth lies at the heart of so many hostile plans. I could not risk jeopardizing his Yeah, this safety. is all in the previous so why video, did you which come here? is longer you knew because I would it follow was... You. A stream. I can't let you this go. Not. Because yes, I you know can. Now you the can let her go because I can't. Still in my veins. No I'm one so but mean. I can put an end to this tragedy. It's a forced relationship. I can help you. You can trust me, Elizabeth. I know, Jonathan. You have been the most loyal ally these last few weeks. Yeah, I just want to talk to your dad but so we can get this head duty. thing over Would with. Would you She straight up decapitates the shit out of him. I have so many questions for him. Go on, Jonathan. But be careful. Yeah, I love how he's like, you have to come closer if you want to talk. And Jonathan's yes, like, so I am pretty sure you can hear me just My fine. God. <laughs> you really are William Marshall. Mm -hmm. You served Richard the Lionheart and his brother, King John. It is such a privilege to meet you. I did in my day. Yeah, 
Come closer if you want to speak. Just fucking jumps on him. For my hearing isn't what it used to be. I think your hearing is fine, sir. What is it you want then? Uh, about the tears of angels, one. we asked all these questions before. And did it? You can yeah. go back and rewatch, just so you. I'm only doing this because I, I want it in the thing. Because I'm like, you, what if there's like other things I can ask because of it? The blood of hate. Ugh. How does all the yellow ones you? force me to do slow pants? Do you feel it the now? The blood of hate. Yes. Nothing more than a sneeze, really. A sneeze held for so long. You could blow a fortress down if you wanted it. William. <laughs> I would plan considering. They are yeah. Of course. Yeah, he's like, oh, there are weird monsters, and I'm like, yeah, I've seen werewolves, but not bat creatures or whatever. <laughs> he's like, well, I maybe you're just not why. looking hard enough. <laughs> Do you remember Murden, your maker? Only God is Murden. my maker, for He created everything on this earth. He blessed me so with you don't eternal remember life Murden. through his archangel, Michael. But Murden, Michael, is a vampire. He made you a blood-sucking creature of the night. Blood, yes. I used to drink it it's from the, the way throats you of the unworthy. Use your newfound gifts, then Jonathan. I was punished for my deceit. He's like so ashamed of During it, but really, penance, he doesn't have to be if he uses them right. I entirely. My sweet Elizabeth. Tell me, I don't please, so after. Yeah, he like better. Like she came by because she realized that she realized that there was something wrong with him, and so she went to see him, and then he like attacked her because of the blood of hate. And then like he was like super upset about it. And she forgave him because it wasn't his fault, of course. The blood of hate corrupts, like absolutely. We could set you free, let you out. Isn't that what you want? Decapitation. I the day I'll see the sky again. I have all but forgotten I had quite the day today at school. I could walk. I stabbed myself and do with a so needle trying to draw blood from a dog. I got one but arm all scratched up from said dog. He wasn't a mean dog. He was just very then will you bouncy. Stay here and repent. <sighs> Another dog tried to bite me, but now. we put a muzzle on him. <laughs> I cannot wait but I pass off on some things that I need to pass off, so, so very excited about that. She releases me. I passed off on a cephalic draw on a dog. I passed yes. off on um, Why not unleash me then? Vaccine see the sky injection vaccines, injections, and pilling on a dog and a cat. You which is great. Are the sky. Um, all its stars. Yeah, that's what I did I'm today. I just have one more blood draw to pass off, so I'm really excited about it. It's a cephalic on a cat. Mine. You were never defeated, my lord. Aww. Aren't you just the best daughter? Now break up with me. She just doesn't Farewell, get it the first time. Father. Whoops. <laughs> and to you also, Jonathan. What do you mean? I can't stand what I've become. This healthy carrier, as you put it. The flames will purify the poison that runs in my veins. No! I won't allow this to happen. Yes, you will. I am Just death, Jonathan. Wherever I go, I can't stand it. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed. No. Champion of Murden. Just let her do Chosen it. to save England from the vampire <laughs> epidemic. I could her. cure you. What do you mean? We are creatures of blood, Elizabeth. Everything about us is in our blood. With time, I could perfect the antidote William Marshall gave you. Trust me, for time is on our side. No, no. Ugh. Gross. That is a risk I cannot take, <laughs> Jonathan. Sorry. I won't bring another such disaster into this world. Elizabeth, no. Trust me. I can save you. No, just let her. Let her do it. How could I trust you, Jonathan? How could I take such a chance? I'll stay here it. with you then. 
As long as we no. must until I no, find we're a gonna, cure. No, we're gonna go back you to have England. No idea what you're talking about, We're gonna Jonathan. go back. Despite his madness, William was strong enough to start the centuries. I doubt we can do the same. Just run. That's where you're wrong. Just, just run away, Since John. I murdered my poor Mary after my rebirth, I vowed to never take a life again, and I've succeeded. I'm not sure I have the strength of character. I'm not like William. I'm not like you. Let me teach you then. Come with me, my love. Oh, Jonathan, if only this could be true, but I really don't know. We'll run away. Go to the deepest forests, the highest mountains. Untouched no, by man, we'll hide in no, solitude Jonathan. until I find a cure. Do Montage. you trust me then? <laughs> Montage relationships are not relationships. World, my love. Oh, well, that could come around at any minute, you know, because uh, another disaster could just, like, pop up for no reason because the Red Queen's a bitch. Just imagine her coming back, like, two years later and Murden's like so here's the thing <laughs> since you're still alive one prayer for the summoned called by this song no. child born from darkness whose path he must find now the song is sung and your path chosen England is safe for you have prevailed I wish you a peace wow we're going to America <laughs> for the centuries yet to come yes oh I hope the next game is in America but I, I go back and I find McCall champion bittersweet my queen sleeps once again and I'll soon join her slumber until alas she rises woken by the hunger no, I never don't wanna but Jeffrey <laughs> That's the only thing that disappoints me about this game, is that I can't choose a romantic option like I could in um, Life is Strange. Because in Life is Strange, you had two choices. Oh, yeah, this is the end. <laughs> I knew I was coming close to the end. So, yeah, this is going to be a really short video. But, you know, can I skip the credits? No, I can't. Um, yeah, that... This game was amazing. The story is amazing. The voice acting is amazing. Um, the animation is amazing. The fighting, I think, is amazing. Um, I love the superpowers that I get and all that stuff. It's just all of it's really cool. The only thing that disappointed me was that I was hoping for options, like in Life is Strange, because they they let you choose between Warren and Chloe, and then at the end they let you choose whether you were going to save Arcadia Bay or let it be destroyed. And I kind of felt like they should have given you that choice here at the end of this game, where you can not only choose your romantic option between certain characters, like it would have been cool to have McCollum, Lady Ashbury, and maybe Sean, I, I don't know. Um, instead of just being like, well, you're a man and she's a woman, so plot <laughs> um yeah it's just kind of disappointing because i felt like having the two different choices having chloe and warren you got to know these two characters their personalities why they cared about max and how much they cared about max um and how like chloe she genuinely loved max but she was also very selfish and Warren had like this huge like big heart he was very sweet and and warm and wanted to make sure that Max was always okay so you get to choose between these two different personalities rather than just being it like like here you have you have to go out with Warren or you have to go out with Chloe so I really wished that had been an option that I could choose between Lady Ashbury and McCollum and just maybe one other person that they could have put in there that would have been very interesting could have even been an, like another vampire or a werewolf just like one random werewolf that would have been really cool but they didn't they kind of went with plot convenience and I didn't really get to know Lady Ashbury uh, enough to form a romantic relationship with her in my mind and I feel like that's kind of important when you're making a game where you want to give your main character a romantic partner is giving them the time to develop a relationship between the person that you as the player are attracted to or that you find interesting and stuff like that and they did not do that with Lady Ashbury. I didn't have any interest in her as a romantic option and I know like I'm poking fun and I'm yelling and like oh no go away um, but really I think that if they had developed her character more 
rather than just like, okay, she's a woman, she's here, she'll pop up when it's convenient, she's an artist or whatever, she's adopted lots of kids, it was her blood that did it, whatever. Um, but there wasn't any real focus on the relationship between her and Jonathan, so it didn't feel like they belonged together. It felt like they were more friends than lovers. So, very disappointing in that aspect. I think it could have been done so much better, and if I could redo this game, I would definitely put in two to three romantic options and let the player decide who they wanted to be with, who they wanted to spend the most time with, who they wanted to get to know the most, um, and, you know, give them reasons. Because, like, between Elizabeth and McCullum, McCullum was the more interesting character. He had a more interesting story. Um, even his, like, small smidge of backstory you got as to why, how and why he became a vampire hunter was way more interesting than Lady Ashbury. And, like, how he has, like, this, like, venomous hate for vampires, but at the same time, he kind of starts to develop this respect for Reed, especially after their fight. How he stops calling him a leech, um, and instead he calls him, like, a blood drinker, or he calls him by his name, which I thought was very interesting. It was, like, a really cool development, you know, like, something that you just didn't expect. You're like, okay, this guy is gonna hate him forever no matter what, but no, they actually developed his character, and that's why I think I was more attracted to him as a romantic option than I was to Elizabeth, is because he was so much more developed and he was so much more interesting, and if the story, if, like, Lady Ashbury hadn't been in the story, I wouldn't have missed her. It could have just been McCollum and Swansea and Sean and me just, like, trying to, like, figure things out and, like, work around these vampire hunters while also finding a cure. Um, and you could have just completely taken Elizabeth out and just had uh, William Marshall, and it wouldn't have lost anything. In fact, I think it would have gained more from the story just because of the lack of development on Donut's part. It's kind of sad. But yeah, other than that, I love this game. This game was so much fun, and I would I am definitely going to be playing it again. I'm going to go back through, and there are going to be some different choices I'm going to make, but just a couple of, like ones that I think I just want to see how they change the story. I'm going to go back through and I'm going to um, I'm going to embrace Swansea. So it'll be my one and only embrace. And I'm going to turn McCollum into a vampire because I want to see how that plays out um, as far as like future things. And also maybe see if I can get rid of Elizabeth. <laughs> I know that sounds mean, but it's just, like I said, I'm not interested in her as a character other than pure platonic friendship. So we'll see where that goes, I guess. <laughs> Maybe someday they'll make another vampire game and you can be Jonathan Reed again and maybe Elizabeth dies or he had to put her down and so he goes back to look for McCollum and Swansea like it would be a really cool like continuation I think um, because yeah just <sighs> she wasn't my cup of tea and I'm sure that they were really like just shoving it in your face like don't you see Lady Elizabeth she's so interesting right and I'm like no not really in fact I ignored her like most of the game unless I was forced to talk to her unless my mission was talk to Elizabeth <laughs> like I just ignored the shit out of her. Like, I had no reason to... Oh, circle is how you skip the credits. <laughs> like, I had no reason to talk to her at all. But, um, other than that, very interesting game. Jonathan's story was awesome. It was sad. Um, a lot of, like, well, not a lot, but a couple of moments had me, like, upset and in tears. Like, when he had to go back and kill Mary. And then when the skulls in the sewer were attacked and slaughtered. The, those moments were very sad, so... But yeah, you, you've you heard my chief complaint. You understand why I feel that way. Um, thank you guys so much for joining me on this journey. I love this game, and yes, I will be going back, and I will be doing, like, little... Just little clips to show you, you know, what happens when I make those decisions. Because I think it would be interesting for you guys to see that, too, and share it with me. But... Yeah, I love you guys so much, and I hope that you enjoyed this, you know, short finale to the game. And I'm really sorry again about the overheating and the crashes. 
Uh, you guys have been great. So yeah, I love you all and I'll see you next time. Okay. All right. Bye.